Two Forks Tower. Um, hello? Whoever this is? It's Henry, right? Yeah. I'm Delilah. Yeah, that's what the guy said on the phone. So, what's wrong with you? Excuse me? People take this job to get away from something. So, what's wrong? What's wrong with you? That's a great idea. Go... Go ahead. Look, I just hiked for two days, so I don't really follow whatever it is you're doing right now. You take a stab at what's wrong with me. Fine, then can I... What, sleep? Forever? Sure, buddy. Okay, now go ahead. Okay, um, you're probably just rebelling against a mom who wishes you had given her grandkids, by the sound of your voice, at least 15 years ago. You come out here and it really grinds her gears and you love it. Can I sleep now? Well, she also says I fuck immature men, but in my defense, who wouldn't want a 28-year-old with ambition and energy and some fire in his belly in bed? Me. I'm going now. <laughs> Just a second. Now it's my turn. Okay. Good night. Bye. Let's see. I don't know anything about you, but nine times out of ten, folks out here simply got dumped. Huh. Is that it? Close. Good night. <laughs> Good night. Welcome to the job. afternoon. <laughs> you probably slept like a rock. Anyway, uh, there's still a few hours of daylight to get some work in. I can see you at your desk, so call me when you're ready. Hey, sorry. Guess I slept in. You got a relaxing, what, 14 hours of sleep? Woo! Yeah, Jesus, I guess it's what, six? 6.45. Whoops. Don't worry about it. That hike puts everyone out of commission for a day or two. But now that you're up, let me quickly get you acquainted with the job. There's a thing in the middle of your room with a round map on it. Do you see it? Okay, yeah, I see it. This is the Osborne Firefinder, invented in 1914 by W.B. Osborne? You use this to spot, you guessed it, fi- What the fuck? What is it? Nothing. Um, you, uh, you use this to- Oh, fuck me! Good God, language, lady. Out your west-facing window. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? Are those fucking fireworks? What? I need you to confirm. Do you see them? Whoa, that's not legal, right? Uh, no. You need to get down there right now and stop them. Fire danger is through the fucking roof. Is that really my job? Your job is whatever I say it is. Look, the closest ranger is like two days away. Go down there and set them straight. Do I write him a ticket? Easy there, Dirty Harry. Well? Get going. You'll probably need a rope to get down the shale between you and the lake, if I remember right. There should be one in the supply box on the way. The code is 1234. It's actually that for all of them. Convenient. That's one word for it.
Hey. What the hell's wrong with you? My rope snapped coming down the shale slide. You didn't break anything, did you? No, I think I'll make it. Well, be careful for Christ's sake. I'm staring at the big outcropping down here, but I'm not quite sure where to look for our uh, pyrotechnicians. Mm. Maybe keep heading west toward the lake. It is a hell of a nice camping spot down here by the lake. I haven't been down there in years, but yeah, Jonesy Lake area is perfect. Oh, look, they decided to have a campfire, too. You know, they color-coded the fire danger signs in case people were illiterate. But I guess that doesn't take into account just plain stupid, does it? They left their packs tied up here. Don't fuck with them. The last thing we need is some hikers filing a report about harassment. They left half a bottle of whiskey. Decent stuff. Drunk pyromaniacs. Fucking great. Found the fireworks. They didn't even try to hide them. Uh, well, confiscate them. Finding a bunch of empty beer cans. They threw them all over hell. Are you fucking serious? Yeah, sure am. Uh, people are just the worst, aren't they? They're not great, no. Well, they left their clothes out to dry. It looks like uh, two people. Well, uh, what if they're naked? Won't that be exciting? Look, they're obviously still there, so tell them off and then head back. I found a bra. A nudie pyromaniac. Remain professional. Uh, there are, uh, panties. There are what? I don't want to say that word again. Why, because you're 12? There's a... Uh, ooh. Yes? There are two naked ladies out here. Can you handle that? Come on, I like naked ladies, same as anyone, but there's, you know... Two? Yeah. I know this will be tough for you, but try to pick your tongue up off the ground and do your job. Okay. Found them in the lake. Skinny dipping. Yeah. Is that a guy over there? Oh boy. <laughs> Enjoy dealing with that.
gotta take it easy with the fireworks, all right? You ought to take it easy at the Sizzler Buffet. <laughs> Chelsea? What? He's just some loser out in the woods. I mean, he's grody. Why do you guys think it's all right to just stare at girls? Look, I'm sorry for bothering you. Can you just knock it off, please? Yeah, you should be. This is a free country, and we should be free to do whatever we want. And free from any peeping Tom. I said sorry. Oh my God, is that what you are? Work me out. Ew. Can we just get out of here? You're gross. You're just some sad man out in the woods. Hey, that go okay? It went fine. Hopefully there won't be any more trouble. Good. Thanks for going down there. Hey, I'm back near that big rock outcropping, but not sure how to get back. I'd head west, back towards the lake, and then turn north towards the canyon. a bit of a confession to make. What is it? Um, look, I was, I was drunk last night when I welcomed you to the job. Yeah, well, you're not the first boss to be guilty of that. I know, I just, I know I can get a little pushy, you know, putting you on the spot about uh, why you're out here and stuff. And you thought it was a good idea to get into your um, love life, I guess you'd call it? Anyway, I'm, uh, I'm sorry. It's fine. I'll, I'll, I'll keep that sort of a thing to, uh, to a minimum. Anyway, let me know when you get back to your lookout.
Hey, I heard some thunder. Yeah, I've got eyes on a storm out to the north. Well, that's bad, right? Because of the lightning? It just means we'll be busy. Hurry home, and try not to get hit by lightning. Yeah, I'm not sure I got a lot of choice in getting struck down. Especially not with your electric personality. Ugh. Hmm, I see my joke did not spark your sense of humor. Ugh! What, you're not enjoying our current conversation? Oh my god, lady. The, the arc of our budding friendship. Oh, I'm just gonna let her have that one. a horn or an antler or whatever. Well, antlers are made of bone, and horns are made of the same stuff as your fingernails. I guess this is a bone. Antler. A ranger must have found it this spring. What's in this cave down here? In Thunder Canyon? Thunder Canyon? Hey, I didn't name it. But in the cave? I don't know, rocks? NFS tells people not to go too far in there. It's pretty dangerous. So... So, I say, fuck it. You're a grown man, you can go where you want. Great. I used to go caving with someone back in Colorado. She loved it. Might be great to explore it sometime this summer. Well, that could be fun. Obviously, be very careful. It doesn't seem that dangerous. Whoa, whoa! Oh, no! Henry! Seriously, it's completely fine in here. 